it is Wednesday, otherwise known as our rest day. We've had a late night, all of us. They went to Fantasmic, we went to the fireworks, we came home, and um, we are actually going to go through with our chill out day, starting with a trip to International House of Pancakes, otherwise known as <coughs> IHOP for pancakes. <coughs> Um, and they're a bit excited about that, so am I. And there's a deal at the moment where you can get two eggs and like two pancakes or sausages and unlimited pancakes for like $5. I think it's Monday to Thursday. So super good value for a family of five and like $25. And also if you sign up to their club, you get a free stack of pancakes, which I've done. So um, we might do that for Lucas because he doesn't generally like anything apart from beige yeah. foods. We'll give them some apples and vitamins when we get home, promise. Let's go to IHOP. Domi, are you excited? I love IHOP, I love pancakes, eggs, I'm American bacon. I'm excited for everything. I'm excited for food. I'm hungry, it's 8.53, usually we are like seven. Yes. Later on today, we have plans for Animal Kingdom, which is why I'm in my tribal wear. We have tribal outfits on. We have a Lion King t-shirt. We have an Everest t-shirt. Millie's wearing a Donald Duck t-shirt. Dom. Donald Duck dress. Um, Every time. <laughs> Jack has his new um, backpack on from Hype, can you turn around? <laughs> and it's so cool because it's a Zerg Buzz Lightyear backpack. Um, and I got it from Next in case anyone is looking for it because I think they sold out on the actual Hype website. He's wearing his Everest t shirt that he got. got the Watch the last shirt. vlogs. Watch the last vlogs, right? Yeah. Where Jack rode Everest for the first time and then he got this t shirt. Um, of you Teddy. And a Teddy. Hey. Lucas's Lion King t shirt is from Primark, new collection. His shorts are from Next. They're really soft and easy to wear and they're all wearing Nike Sunrays because they are the most comfortable shoes in the world. Millie's wearing a dress, I got that from AliExpress, it's a Donald Duck dress. She wore it in the last vlogs, Nike Sunrays. And it is another gorgeously hot day, isn't it guys? Oh, I mean, it's it's behind us, you're getting my sunglasses. Oh, yeah. And it is hot, hot, hot. Aloha. Okay, Aloha. Aloha. We're getting used to it finally and i have to say the best thing about this resort is that it feels like you're a million miles away from like the hustle and bustle of disney and it feels like a holiday place this feels like chilled maybe that's why i'm so chilled and we are at a hop which is open 24 hours a day you can get pancakes 24 hours a day it's like the best like tesco ever and here it is and super busy it's next to like a huge gift shop we're literally like a minute out of Disney, aren't we, Dom? Yeah, that so. did not take long at all. And I'll oh. show you this. It's nine in the morning, February, 24 degrees. Oh. I think we got lucky. I think we got really lucky. It's freezing in Cumbria as well. Sorry, Cumbria people. Also, look, there's a sign in the window that says, if you are here on February 23rd, it is National Pancake Day and you will get free pancakes. We're going home, sorry, Dom. We're not going to be here. Yeah. Let's go and eat some pancakes. Finally, yeah. I've learned how to put my seatbelt on. Off. That's really good. You're not hot, Jack. No, no. I'm not hot. I'm oh, so used to the weather. You're going to be shocked when we go back to Cumbria. <laughs> the door handles are. And the kids have some sort of like menu with a crayon in it, which is cool. So there's something for the kids to do because we bought a whole bag of activities because I couldn't remember. Didn't know. I don't know if we've ever come here with them. No, let's see what your breakfast menu is. Oh look, funny face pancake combo. A junior pancake is like all sorts. Grilled cheese sandwich, chicken nuggets, everything. I've just asked about this offer because it doesn't seem to be on the menu. So I'll see if it's still on. So it's worth asking if you see about an offer because it was on. So most of us got that apart from Millie who got the funny face combo. Cream and some sausage and some scrambled eggs but not as many eggs as we have. So. Oh my goodness, look at this. Look at all the syrups, it's strawberry, peanut, butter, butter pecan, pecan, pecan. blueberry, so an old fashioned traditional, and I think you could probably ask for sugar free syrup if you wanted it too, couldn't you? Where does it have eight tentacles? It has eight tentacles and two arms. Not a lot of people know that. I think it has ten tentacles. But you all know it now. I want to tell you something. If you leave your parents, you should go to Disney World because you should live in the Polynesia because the beach is a um, view to it and the, and the swimming pool yeah. and, and Lilo's 
Playhouse is here too. Food is here. This is what I got for five dollars. Two bacon, two um, pancakes. Was well, unlimited Can pancakes and eggs. And Jack has the same with sausage Can as his Luca. Dom has the same mine. as me. I'll and Millie wants to show you hers. It's a very big you guys enjoy, okay? Thank you. Well, that was a successful meal, I have to say. Everyone really enjoyed it. They want to come back. $40. Really good. We need a few more bits of food. So we are at Walmart. And this Walmart is like a minute out the Disney gates, isn't it? Yeah, literally like super, super close. I guess the closest like supermarket type thing. Look at my parking camera. This car has like a camera you don't above even its head. Look out the windows, although you should. It's mad. In we go to Walmart. We're strapping a little two in because it's just easier to go shopping like that. This is the size of Walmart, look. Whoa! We spent hours in here. Hours. Whoa, look at all the cereal. Look how big this bag of Lucky Charms is. What is that? Almost a kilo. A kilo of cereal. Cookies and cream cereal. Wow, this, this is uh, some way to start your day, isn't it? Just cookies with milk. Oh, cookie crisps. There is a massive Disney section. Everything bags, autograph book, magnets, t-shirts for men, women. Like it goes all the way back. Um, like Mickey Mouse t-shirts, $12. Star Wars t-shirts. So like if you feel like you haven't got enough stuff, come to Walmart. All these glasses, which are always good for like character things. Um, so many girls bits, I cannot tell you. They've got the mini me t-shirt that I was gonna make. It's like $10. So many good t-shirts here, I cannot tell you. Stationery, photo frames, albums, pajamas, bags, necklaces, jewelry, lanyards, thousands of lanyards. Like everything you can imagine is here. Hats, oh wow, it's just, it's endless. It's actually endless. I'm gonna move it on to like teddies. I'm going into some Harry Potter stuff. Some more bags, oh look, loads of bum bags, $7. $7.90, so much cheaper than $30 of um, the Magic Kingdom. Water bottles, fans, well done Millie. So loads of stuff. Everything you might need for the pool, beach balls, if you've got a villa, swim shoes, flip flops, beach towels, frisbees, yeah, bubbles. You need an extra suitcase? No. You need travel stuff? No. You need plugs? No. They got it. This section, this might actually be very handy for people. $28.98 for a stroller and it's a Minnie Mouse one too. Can't get better than that because if you come and think, my child doesn't need a stroller, they might. Here and they've got car seats $35, boosters for $20, boosters for $13.68. Nice boosters too. They've got the link things that I have for the wrists. And then we come out to the Toys! Oh my goodness, look at all this Lego. All the toys in Walmart, but there's nothing like a big ball to keep us happy. It's pretty cool in Walmart, it's called Big Airbrush, and it's custom hand-painted t-shirts and hats. You can get like any, any t-shirt for about $20. Millie loves babies. Okay, I'm not doing you anymore because you're not recording. Still chilling out in our hotel room. Wait, wait, say it again because I wasn't ready yet. Hi, we're just chilling out in our hotel room. I've had a shower, we've done some laundry. We decided to have a little rest and now we're going to go on over to Animal, Animal Kingdom. Kingdom. Okay, that's enough. So, it is about five o'clock at night and uh, we're just heading out. I'm heard of for us. Really, it's unheard of. Yeah, it's a rest. It's supposed to be a rest stop. We only booked Animal Kingdom as like an in case, and we're going to cancel most of the fast passes. So really? Can you tell us what happened? I mean, you walked into a bin. So we're heading out. It's a nice and cool though now, so it'll be much better for Animal Kingdom. Hopefully, 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 it'll be a bit quieter at the park as well, which will be nice. But I have got some for gecko. It's in the bushes over there. But yeah, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous evening. It's um, cooled down nicely, but I have got long sleeve tops in the bag because I think they will get cold later. Mommy, we're gonna miss a bird. 
We're not gonna get the bus, we're gonna go take the car. Well, despite getting slightly lost because neither of us had, had actually sat, set the sat nav, so it was actually sending us back to our resort. It only took us about five, six minutes to get here, so really good. It looks quite um, empty, um, and I just saw the, the big bits of Pandora sticking out, which is always exciting. So we're gonna There's try Everest. and- Oh, Everest in the distance. Millie, that goes with your theme of songs. Ain't no mountain high enough. another song Ain't from her show no and shotgun Tin do you know any awesome? so we are in animal kingdom or you're parked close enough to walk she says uh the lady said so in peacock 13 so i guess a lot of people have left here we are animal kingdom you're excited john yeah. I feel like we came at the right time. It's nice and cool now. It gets really, really hot in this park. Like, I don't know why. It's like six degrees hotter than everywhere else. Oh. So it's a good part to come when it's a bit cooler in the evening. We're stopping for a little photo pass photo in a Lion King thing. I'm now on a mission to try and get as many photo pass photos as I can. Cause we've done not very well on that. And there is a lovely Animal Kingdom sign. Always going to use my lane even though there's nobody here. We are going to Everest. Well, it's a really important one to them because it's the first time Millie's going on. I'm not going on. I'm not a huge fan of rides, as you know. So I'm not going to go on and I'm not that bothered, really. Um, I just like to walk around and see if you don't like rides. Disney's also for you because you can like have a really good time just looking, to be honest. You don't even need to go on the rides. And I didn't for a long time. I do go on some now. Happiest child in the world until she's not. It's how they entice you and then it never stops. We are completely sucked into pin trading. But on a separate note, how amazing is the tree of life? Absolutely incredible. Amazing. It's like awe inspiring and the more you look at it, the more you see. See, I'm so sucked in. I'm like, oh, limited edition pins available. I need, I need. Dance party. It's like Millie's heaven. These two don't care. trees Dom to the left uh, we can see the top of Everest if you're on the dining plan you can for one credit do a package at Tusker House which is also worth doing um, lots of people love the food we like the food uh, it's a nice escape from the heat when it's really hot but anyway you can do a one package a one credit package which um, includes a kind of fast pass thing to rivers of light so guaranteed seating so you don't have to do that queue because i don't think it even starts for like an probably an hour maybe more and people are already queuing so that's what we're doing if you get the free dining plan or just buy the dining plan um, we've done it many times pretty much every time we come i was just saying it's well worth doing on the um the package at tusker house for the rivers of light yeah, seating it's really good as well it is really good see some people love it I like it, Dom could eat there for days. I mean, like everything. Really nice buffet, really good characters as well. Really good pog juice, but adults, grown ups, even if it's breakfast time, you may have an alcoholic beverage, so get your mimosa on, um, which is obviously yeah, Buxford's um, or a Bellini. So you can have an alcoholic beverage with any of your meals, whether you're quick service, normal dining, or obviously deluxe, which I could never do. Far too much food. I really like the middle plan. Going to Everest? It's my first time Her first time, she's braver than me. So, while they're on the road, I'm going to have a little walk around and isn't it pretty? It's so pretty everywhere. It really does feel like you're in Asia. As someone who has been to Asia, it does feel very, very similar. Just here is a really good ice cream truck at Colourful Stand. The ice creams are big. One snack credit. Get, get like a little bowl or ask them for a cup as well, you can split it. 
So snack credit, or I have no idea how much it is because I've never paid for anything because we've always had the plan. So waffle cone is 4 .99, so not that bad. Vanilla chocolate or twist, and I would ask for a cup because you could definitely split that one. And isn't it a cool van? So cool. Right, you guys ready? Yeah. Where are we going? The boys have done it. It's Millie's first time. You a bit nervous, Mills? You want me to sit next to you? All right, let's go in. We're in the queue. If you've never done this ride, the queue is quite amazing. It's like base camp, Everest. Feels all Nepalese. So it's very cool. So we just had to swap trains because Luke is only six. We have to be in the same car before we were in two different cars. They actually wanted him to sit with me. Right, can't do that because I got Millie. Here we go. Millie's a bit scared. I think the boys are having fun now. And now for the big fly, Millie. Are you excited? No, I'm You're a bit scared, eh? That's okay. that a five years old Millie's on this ride. I have no idea what she's gonna think of it. Let's see. It's quite intense. Look. Millie, how was it? I didn't like it that much. That was slow. No? Millie, which way didn't you like? I didn't like the like the mouse or the dark ones. You didn't like the dark bit, but you like the actual ride. You're running around the front. She's scared of the, the weirdest thing. She's not scared of the actual ride. She's scared of the dark. There's not just one big fat food truck. Yeah. There's several. There's not just one, but there's several. Do you guys think Mummy would like it? And in true, oh, it's really fun. It's a and in true fun. Everest fun. tradition, uh, first time riders get a prize. Can we go again? Well, I never got anything. Really the Rivers of Light is going to start very soon, I think, and the lotus flowers are now all lit up and it's all dark. Very beautiful. Look at that view. Everest in the background. And then the lotuses open up and in each one is a beautiful like water show. Millie went on Everest again, didn't you Millie? We're gonna go on um, Triceratops spin. It's so nice. It's like chilled, isn't it, Millie? Tea butter. That's a cool popcorn bucket. Do you remember the boneyard? Last time we went in there, it was so hot, wasn't it, Luke? It was. Like 100 it's degrees, but. This is a good place for parents. This is. Yeah. So yeah, this is the boneyard, and it's just like a place where kids can climb and play. Parents can just kind of sit on the side and like watch, or if you're like me and Dom, play. <laughs> We're gonna try and make it to Epcot. Where if we don't? But I think they're gonna fall asleep in the car and then it's fine. If we don't want to, then it's a car in the car. Come on, Luke, quickly. I don't know, this one does not fly a full seat very easily. He's quite an adventurous little dude. He's a good one to do things with though, because he's not scared of anything, are you Luke? I'm sure I used to be like that when I was little. Just stopping in the gift shop on the way out. Hey, it's huge. So coming over there, there's all stuff around there. And then it keeps going. Hannah's looking at limited edition pins for Lucas. See, Hannah always says the kids love pin trading, but I think she likes it just as much. Like a light show on the Street of Light. I've never seen that before. Yeah, we thought we weren't the only mental people because there were lots of people driving the same way as us. Um, and then we realised that most of them were going to Magic Kingdom. It's open till 11 with extra magic hours. But top tip: if you don't want to pay for parking, 
Come to Epcot half an hour before it closes and it's free. Uh, I don't know if we're going to make it or they're going to let us in or anything really. We'll just go find a space right at the front there's going to be no one here. Like mm -hmm. literally everyone's leaving. <laughs> it's quite funny. Never mind. We made it. Did not think we'd make it. There are another two people, weren't there? Yeah, there are a few others going in. I thought there might be some rule, like no entry half an hour before close. But we're here. As long as we're on the ride before okay. nine, they'll let us ride it. So. Millie is asleep though, so. Then let's bring the stroller in. Okay, there's no one else here. And, and she's, she's faster. So cute. She's so cute. She's cute. Sunshine season's cupcake. Mm. Oh, someone's happy, yeah, I need it. 10 minute wait, Dom. That's Disney code for no wait. It's always 10 minutes to walk yeah. through. You know, get less than 10. What about um, Everest? There was 15. Was there a wait? It was a small wait. Okay, so it was like a five minute wait, right? He's happy as anything. He's like walking, which is unheard of for him. He's skipping, which is definitely unheard of. You've probably seen all our vlogs. You ever seen Lucas do this? <laughs> Anyone? Have you, yeah, have you ever seen Lucas? We do have a third child. <laughs> I mean, seriously, he's skipping. He's still sk He's running. This child doesn't move or talk or do anything. You go, Lucas. So despite begging us to wake her up, Millie didn't make it. She's like fast asleep. My name is Patrick. Actually half empty. Really cool. That was definitely as good as I remember. Um, I feel bad that Dom didn't get to come on. Aww. I think we were the last ride of the night too. Oh really? Well look, there's no one else coming on. He's so happy, it's so good. It is worth it just for this reaction. This little dance, this little boy having so much fun. He's not a good sleeper anyway. It takes him forever to go to sleep, so maybe maybe he will be tonight. Oh, really? Or maybe we'll be too excited now. <laughs> <laughs> we did it, we made it, don't we? We made it. Most of us. Wow, that's us leaving Epcot. And Lucas, I don't know if we make it wants to go on to Big Thunder Mountain in Magic Kingdom. Because it's 9.30 now, Magic Kingdom's open until 11 tonight. So a slight change plan, Lucas fell asleep in the car as we kind of expected. So it's almost 10, I'm just going to head over, closes at 11 tonight and then probably jump on Space Mountain, maybe see what else there is to do. Seems like a pattern for tonight. I'm walking in, everyone else is walking out. Castle looking great as always. All right, I'm going to head over to Space Mountain I think. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I'd never done that before. So they scan your magic band to make sure you're entitled to the extra magic hours. Uh, I might have said this once or twice before, but I love Space Mountain. It's just such a fun ride. I was tempted to go twice in a row, but then I wouldn't have time for anything else. So I think I'm going to try and get on Seven Dwarfs, and that'll be it for the night. But hey, that's still pretty good. Right, so that's the end of our Wednesday. Um, it's quite late. It's 10.24. Dom's gone to Magic Kingdom. Um, to ride a couple of rides while Extra Magic Hours is on. I've just put all the kids to bed and now I'm going to bed myself um, and Dom should be home soon after 11 so he'll go to bed too. I've laid out their clothes for Rise of Resistance. I don't know if it's going to happen. We'll see. Um, Lucas really wants to um, like and subscribe if you like what you see. Ring that bell and it will let you know every single time um, we put up a new vlog. Um, and with that, I'm going to say good night. See you in the next vlog. That is an awesome ride. That was so fun. Got to go on two great rides, two of my favourites, and that was a really fun night. And after the other two parks, we've done three parks today. So time to head home with everyone else. One final shot at the castle at night. I can definitely recommend extra magic hours if you can stay up for them. And so with that, I'll say good night. Another fantastic day at Disney. And more to come. I'll see you next time.